Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're diving into a common challenge faced by many developers. Our viewer asks, how can I convert a Lambda with a parameterized constructor to a method reference? Let's break down the question. Imagine you have a class called Gizmo, which requires a string parameter in its constructor. You want to transform a list of strings into a list of gizmos using Java streams. You might start with a stream operation that maps each string to a new gizmo instance. However, IntelliJ suggests that you can simplify this with a method reference. But here's the catch. Method references seem to not accept parameters. So what's the solution? Welcome to another tech video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy, like me, and hopefully get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to that video. Let's start by understanding the problem. We have a class called Gizmo that has a constructor accepting a string parameter. We want to convert a list of strings into a list of gizmos. Initially, we might use a lambda expression to achieve this. IntelliJ suggests that we can replace the lambda expression with a method reference. This is where it gets interesting. Even though method references cannot directly take parameters, we can create a static factory method in the Gizmo class to facilitate this. Now we can use this method reference in our stream operation, making our code cleaner and more concise. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're told to convert a lambda with a parameterized constructor to a method reference, it means you can simplify your code. Instead of using a lambda expression to create a new object, you can directly reference the constructor. For example, the Lambda expression that creates a new gizmo can be replaced with a method reference to the gizmo constructor. For more details on using constructor method references in Java, check out the link provided. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. Using a method reference instead of a lambda expression can optimize your code. While lambda expressions create an extra method in your class, method references do not. In your case, when you use a lambda like t to new gizmo t, the compiler generates an additional method, but with a method reference, this extra method is avoided. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. A method reference is a reference to a method, including constructors. For example, if you have a person class with a constructor that takes a name and age, you can create a by function to instantiate person objects using a lambda expression.
You can define a by function using a lambda like this. By function person creator equals name age, new person name age. However, since the parameter types match the constructor, you can simplify it using a method reference. By function person creator equals person new. This method reference works seamlessly. You can create a new person like this. Person Jane equals person creator dot apply Jane 23. Remember, the key is that the parameter types must match the constructor's signature. For more information on method references, check out the Java tutorial on method references. It's a great resource for understanding this concept further. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your question I hope, and you found that resolution. Guys, if this helped, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, have a good one.